It's a fun sport, no matter how old you are, and you get to tag your opponent with paint. Yeah, Rhonda Moore joins us now to tell us what you need to know to play paintball. Good morning. When you come to paintball country, the first thing you want to make sure is that you're dressed appropriately. You don't want to wear anything nice. You want to wear your worst set of clothes so that, you know, you don't mind getting paint all over. Now, joining me now is Brian Garver. And tell me, what will you put on before you get out there and actually start playing with the paintball? Sure. Well, we're going to give you uh, safety equipment that you need in order to keep you safe while you're playing. So the first thing is going to be the mask that we're going to give you. And every player needs to wear a mask the entire time they're playing to protect your eyes and your face. Uh, we have a chest protector that you can rent that will protect, obviously, your chest. And then we also have a neck guard that's available. Those are both available to rent for $5 a piece. Okay. And then when you load the gun, how do you do that? Sure. Well, sometimes this is the most difficult part of the day is getting all the paint into the hopper. Uh, your bag is going to have 500 paint balls, but your hopper is only going to hold 200. So you want to make sure you realize that. And then also you're going to want to get that top snapped on there to make sure that when you raise the gun up later, you don't drop the paint out the back of your gun. So do you show everyone how to load the gun? Absolutely. Yep. Our staff is going to uh, walk you right through the process. They're going to show you all the safety features of loading the gun and using the gun. And then they're also going to be with you out there on the field to make sure that you are having a safe and enjoyable time while you're playing here. All right. And how popular is paintball? It is very popular. Paintball started out many years ago as a way to mark trees for loggers and uh, the story has it that two loggers turn on each other and decide to shoot each other, and you have a, a sport that's and born. And voila, you there got a you game. Go. That's right. <laughs> All right, sounds good. Well, if you want to come to Paintball Country, it is open on Saturdays from 11 a.m. until 5 p.m. and Sundays 1 until 5 here on the Niederman Farm, located at 5110 Lasoursville, West Chester Road in Liberty Township. Back to you guys. Ooh, good shot, Rhonda. Did you get me? No. <laughs> I okay. think you're good. good. All right. I would like this real quick. We dodged it. It's a game first played back in the 80s. Very popular now as well. Rhonda Moore is learning the rules of paintball. Good morning. I've got my gear on. I've got my gun. And now I'm ready to play paintball. But first, we need to find out the rules. So joining me now is Brian Garver. We have a few rules, and they're simple, but you got to follow them. The first is, whenever you're on the field, you've got to have this mask on. It's the most important piece of equipment you have. It's going to protect your eyes and your face from a paintball. Okay. Once you have your mask on and you're out on the field, then you can take the barrel bag off the end of your gun. The barrel bag is this little bag on the end of your gun, so that if we don't have our mask on and you'd happen to pull the trigger, the ball is going to break in here instead of flying out and hitting somebody on your face. Okay. So once you get out on the field, you can take the barrel bag off the gun. Okay. Now, once you're out on the field, when you get hit, you need to check and make sure the ball breaks on you because if the ball doesn't break on you you are not out sometimes they do bounce all right are you trying to get to a certain amount of points nope the object of the game in this game is going to be to eliminate the other team so you keep shooting until the other team is gone all right that sounds pretty simple all right and the last thing we have is that we have a 10-foot rule here at paintball country so that means if somebody is within 10 feet of you you need to give them the option to surrender before you shoot them uh, if they decide not to surrender, then you can light them up. All right, and if people come out here and they're not dressed in the right clothing, you guys have some clothing that they can go ahead and yes. rent and then come on out here and yeah. play. Yeah, we'll have some disposable items that you can rent or you can use to cover up your clothes. The paint does wash out, uh, but if you are concerned about uh, you know your clothes, you can certainly rent some, some coveralls for that. All right, it's a lot of fun out here, and if you want to come to Paintball Country, it's open on Saturdays from 11 a.m. until 5 p.m. and Sundays 1 until 5 p.m. here on the Needle Farm located at 5110 Lasoursville West Chester Road in Liberty Township and we'll be back at 850 and we'll tell you how many different fields you can play on. Back to you guys. I'd be careful if Rhonda's out there. Yeah, she's got yeah. a good shot. She looks like she's having fun too. There are lots of fields to play on <laughs> and lots of obstacles in this next game. Paintball is a lot of fun of course but Rhonda Moore says you still have to be careful. Good morning having a good time out here at paintball country playing on these different fields and this is Brian Garver all right how many fields do you guys have that people can play on we have 11 fields that are playable uh, six of them are what's called a speedball field it's a field like this that's flat that has maybe a man-made bunker on it then we have five woods fields that are in the woods that have some man-made bunkers and some are just kind of natural you hide behind trees and, and all kinds of stuff out there so you have like a lot of obstacles and things like this Do, are you jumping over these things what are you doing you can you can jump over them you can hide behind them you can run around them uh, you can get as creative as you want we've put as much out here as we think we need to make it fun pretty much everybody starts on this field that we're on right here we call this the boat field 
The bunkers are really big and it gives you a good idea of how to use your gun and then we'll move you over to the other fields. And how long can you stay out here on the fields? Usually a game lasts between uh, 15 and 25 minutes. Ah! I got hit in the head. Whew. Wait, that hurt. I'm gonna have a concussion. <laughs> I got hit in the head. <laughs> Now tell me a little bit about the paint itself. Is this something that can wash off easily if you get it all over you? It sure is. The paint is actually cornstarch based. Uh, so when it dries, it's going to dry to a white powder and flake away. It will wash out of your clothes and uh, it's good for the environment. All right, but you still don't want to wear anything too nice out here. Right, when you exactly, about. exactly. All right, sounds good. If you want to come out here and have fun at Paintball Country, it is open on Saturdays from 11 a.m. until 5 p.m. and Sundays from 1 until 5 here on the Niederman Farm located at 5110 Lasoursville Westchester Road in Liberty Township. Back to you guys. She is pelting us. Yeah, watch Wonder out if she for Rhonda. Like you or me. I don't know. Maybe it's both of us, right? <laughs> Maybe. <yeah. laughs>